What's up everyone? Welcome back. If you're new here, I'm Aditya Murukuri, the host for Tats Podcast, the great feature for your bright future. Today, we are going to learn about how to manage your time. Isn't it simple? No guys, when it's when you listen to this verse, it might be simple, but when you really want it to do, it's a tough thing. So let me give you some tips. Number 1, organize the night before. In order to have your priorities lined up for each work day, make a list of things that you have to do the night before and evaluate the importance of those projects. By committing your priorities to paper, you psychologically enter into a contract with yourself because it creates a greater responsibility in your mind to get these things done. Number 2, start the day early. Coming up short on time toward on the day end of the day. Go into the office 30 minutes early. It will give you some breathing room with the day and the start the day. With important alone time, there's nothing better than starting the day fully organized and ready to go. It also gives you small time to catch up and early morning emails and rethink about today's priorities. Know your priorities. Plan to spend at least 50% of your time engaged in the thoughts, activities and conversations that produce most of your results. Quadrant 2 tasks take 2 to 3 minutes before every call and task to decide task to decide what results you want to attain. This will help you know what success looks like before you start and it will also slow time down. Take the same time after each call and activity to determine whether you desire result and what and not. If not, what was missing? How do you put what's missing in your next call? Next, what to the plan? Work to the plan. When you can visualize how you plan your day to go, you can cut back the downtime. Got enough work done. Put some time in the gym or talk to your family. If you can schedule and plan accordingly, you will never run off to, out of the time. Any activity or conversation that's important to your success should have a time assigned to it. To do lists get longer and longer to the point where they are unworkable. Appointment book work. Schedule appointments with yourself and create time blocks for high priority thoughts. Conversations and action schedules. When they will begin then have the discipline to keep these appointments be realistic when you create a plan and a schedule it's important to be realistic about what you can actually accomplish in a work day and prioritize accordingly and don't forget to leave yourself some wiggle room in your schedule in case something unexpected comes up as it frequently will stay organized Keeping up with an organizer that holds every appointment, you will cut down on any wasted time. Most people think they can get away with just creating mental notes. But that's not a good planning. Keeping your life in order with something concentrate will aid in cutting down stress. Tidying your desk and working, working space can also keep your work consistent. Plan time to pull it away from what you are doing. Avoid distractions. Easily, the hardest thing to do all the day at work is to be able to focus to all times. We all struggle with distraction. But being able to get back to the horse and stay focused is a great talent. Especially in a world of social media and growing communication technology, it's easy to get off working path. Strive to the stay of Facebook, Instagram, Twitter or anything else that will keep your glue to your screen. There are more important things to do at the work. Put a do not disturb sign when you absolutely have to get work done. Practice not answering the phone just because it's ringing and emails just because they show up. Disconnect instant messaging. Don't instantly give people your attention unless it's absolutely crucial in your business to offer an immediate human response. 
instead schedule a time to answer email and return phone calls so this is today's episode on how to manage your time hope i conveyed some value added content for you for a simple summary visit instagram at inside the pages 984 thank you for listening this episode i am aditya mulukuri the host for the aditya stocks and show thank you peace